welcome to vijay tech academy today we will solve one of the question from sarjit edc and the topic is rectifiers so in this question a full wave rectifier is given and it is also mentioned that the diodes are ideal so whenever the diode is ideal in the forward bias condition there is no voltage drop across the diodes now here and the input is also applied here 10 sin omega t and the average value is given we are asked to find the value of n a n is the number of turns, number of terms in this winding. So let us see how to solve this question. So first, based on the given value, the average value of for the rectifier, average value means or average voltage means we can take it as the DC voltage and VDC is equal to 2 into Vm by pi. This is the formula for full wave rectifier. 2 Vm by pi is equal to and it is given as 2.5 by pi. So 2 Vm by pi is equal to 2.5 by pi and pi and pi gets cancelled and you will get Vm is equal to 1.25 volts. Okay, now here, let us solve the voltage across secondary winding. So this is the primary winding and this one is secondary winding. We are applying 10 sin omega t across the primary winding. So the voltage across secondary winding is, so here the voltage applied is again directly proportional to the number of turns. So V1 by V2 is equal to, we can write N by 1. And after substituting V1 is equal to 10 sin omega t, you will get V2 is equal to 10 by N sin omega t. And this is the voltage, this 10 by N sin omega t is the voltage across the secondary winding. But here the given transformer is center tap transformer. So phi by N sin omega t is the developed across upper of and pi by n sin omega t is the voltage developed across the lower half of the secondary winding. But here, while simplifying or while solving the full wave rectifier in the derivations, here what is Vm here? Vm is the voltage across the upper of or lower of. We will consider only one. So Vm is equal to the voltage across the upper of the secondary winding. So we have to substitute pi by n is equal to Vm and Vm we already got it as 1.25. So what is the value of n? So pi by 1.25 which is the answer is 4. So the number of turns in this question is 4 is to 1. So n value is 4. So in this there are several options are given 4, 8, 12 and 16. Out of those we have to select the 4. So if you are watching our channel first time kindly subscribe our channel. If you like this video kindly share it to your friends. Thank you.